What's up guys and welcome back to Fishy Angler's channel. Today I made my way to a local creek. As you know, last week was cold pretty much everywhere in the country. Everything got frozen and uh, but we had three days uh, air temperature about 60 degrees and I thought, you know, I'll find a place where, where the ice already thawed out and uh, I can launch my kayak. So and I got to one place and uh, nope. The ice still there and looks like wind just pushed all the ice in the spot where I wanted to fish. So I couldn't launch and that's why I decided to come uh, to a creek. Water is moving here so I thought, you know, the ice is not going to stay and I was right. But let's see what we can catch here. Uh, there's a white perch and um, a crappie and all kinds of panfish here. So. I hope I can catch something today because that those frozen waters on the, in the ponds and uh, in other places is just impossible to fish. So let's get to it. Let's wet the line and see what we can catch. All right, guys. I'm starting with night crawlers. Uh, under barber and let's see what we can get if we'll get any bites the water temperature is still cold pretty much everywhere even in spots like this even though it's not frozen but it is about 40 about 34 35 degrees so, all right, so let's get warm on the hook and we'll cast. Let's see if anything bites. And I cast it right in a bunch of garbage. I'll start with this with worms and then I have some small jigs and uh, artificial plastics I'll try that too all right so far nothing on the worm no bites so I'm gonna try the jig and see if I'll get any reaction strikes or anything. And then if not in here, I'll move to another side. I'll move to the other side of the bridge over there. Looks like there's a quiet spot there because the water running on this side and then just going turns to the left but over there it's kind of quiet spot there's a pocket with pretty much not moving more water or just very very slow moving water I'll try there all right but before I go there I'll try on a jig all right <clears throat> these are small jigs that I have on this rod and I'm gonna pair it with those tiny plastics okay here they are let's see all right guys uh, no bites on this side no worm bite no jig bite so I'm gonna move to the other side maybe I'll have more luck there it's 
previously when I fished here I tried this side and I didn't get any bites but on the other side I got plenty of fish so let's hope that's the case today or with this water temperature they may not even bite at all so my dinky uh, thermometer showed me 41 degrees but that thing may not be as accurate as I would hope but anyhow I'm not giving up yet I'm gonna go on the other side uh, in that uh, in that pool over there so let's see if we get anything there Again. Let's cast over there and see if we can catch anything. Let's see if fish is here. This pool here is standing as you can see. It's kind of a little swirl but it's really slow. So there may be some fish here. I've been here last year and uh, there were tons of fish in this pool. So hopefully there are some today and they're gonna bite. All right. I just got first bite. There it is. <laughs> and the first fish. And look at that. It's a bass. <laughs> All right. So they are here. And as you can see, it's a decent bass. There you go. This is the first fish of 2023. I hope the whole 2023 is not gonna be just things like that. But hey, it's a fish. And it's okay, boss. <laughs> All right. So let's see what else is in here. This is a tidal water here. So as you can see, water now leaving, so it's outgoing tide. So the level is gonna drop here. A few times previously, I fished here uh, and I fished on the low tide. And one time there was tons of yellow perch and uh, bluegill and I caught some other fish here too as well. Um, so there is also crappie here, but uh, I didn't get a chance to catch crappie here. So hopefully we may catch today something, but who knows, we'll see. Today is really slow. So I'll, I've been here for an hour and I just got that one bass. So, but who knows? They may start biting in the afternoon later in the afternoon that's what that's what happened to me one time I mean I was fishing 
uh, probably from from noon and for a couple of hours it was nothing pretty much at all but then around three o'clock in the afternoon they just start taking it like crazy so I was catching one after another so we'll see the fish is here I just hope it will bite but at least I got one so I'm not skanked I'm happy I mean it would be a bad bad luck probably to go out on first uh, fishing in 2023 and, and get skunked <laughs> that wouldn't be a good sign so so far it's good okay guys I'm getting a bite well and fish on ah, came off well after more than two hours I saw another bite so but now as you can see the tide went out and uh, it's a low tide here look at the shore now it's probably like two two feet lower at least than uh, when I came here and a low tide I just got another bite and something came off something small but hey you never know the tide may change the lot and they may start biting you never know all right so let me cast over there so let's see looks like I'm getting another bite but looks like it's small ones they're just nipping on a on a worm they cannot even swallow it looks like nope something really really small hey you bastards You little bastards. Yeah, gotcha. Uh, look what I got. These are the little things that get in it. The shiner. <laughs> you bastard. He barely got the hook. <laughs> Tiny shiners. All right, but they're here. I mean, last time I was here, I was pulling up some decent shiners. I mean, like this big. So, but today, looks like a bunch of small ones sitting in the cover there. All right, I'm gonna bait the hook again and see. There is another one. There is another one. Oh, this one a bit better. Ah, oh, it's a yellow perch. Oh, that's a nice perch. Nice. So yeah, looks like low tide turned them on. Ooh, hey. That's a nice yellow. All right. Yep, the tide makes a difference. Yeah, it looks like it starts getting darker. So not long left for me to fish here. I don't know, maybe another 40 minutes or so. 
but we'll see. Maybe at the end of the day, I'll catch something. The whole afternoon, beginning of the afternoon was completely dead. So now it's, it looks like, like it's slack, slack tide. And they decided to come out and play a little bit. Something else is nipping on the on the wall. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, nope. All right. Let's see. Yeah, and they biting. Start biting right away as soon as it hits the water. These little ones, and and the rain came out of nowhere. Gonna, it's gonna pass. Looks like it's a cloud here coming over. Yeah, little ones nipping on the bobber, uh, on, on the worm. <laughs> the bobber is barely moving. Come on. Take it already. All right, something else is biting. Yep, gotcha. I gotcha. You tiny shiner. <laughs> Look at these guys. Those little bastards sitting down there. I'm just nipping on the worm. Yeah, another one, another one. <laughs> another small shiner. Yay! There he is. Off you go. I mean, everything <clears throat> everything is frozen now. I mean, it could be nice to get the, those small shiners and use for bait. But everything is frozen. And who knows when it's gonna thaw out. So today we're gonna be fishing just for fun. And there you, there you go, guys. <laughs> yeah, another one. And that's a bluegill. It's a nice size bluegill. All right. Well, they decided to bite in the evening. It's already getting dark. And they decided to start biting. <laughs> Fish on! <laughs> and another shiner. A bunch of things today. <laughs> yep. Ah, oh, came off. <laughs> Bastard. Well, guys, there you have it. This is January 2nd, 2023. So I came out to this creek 
at least I got some fish so hopefully that would be good precedent for 2003 fishing year so of course I didn't come here for giants or anything but at least I got some fish and now it's already dark I could barely see the bobber anymore so and on this I'm gonna wrap up this video and if you guys like this video hit the like button subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet and I'll see you all next time